In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to add a signature on Ionos in under five minutes. This seemingly small task can greatly enhance your professional communication by automatically appending your contact details, company logo, or any legal disclaimers to every email you send. Let's dive right in. First things first, navigate to the Ionos website. Once there, you'll see a plethora of options, but our target for today lies within the sign in button, typically located at the top right corner of the page. Click on it and you'll be greeted by a sign in page. Now it's time to access your customer account. You'll see an option for customer account. Go ahead and select it. This action will prompt another sign in process. It's here you'll enter your credentials. Start by typing in your email address. Make sure it's the one associated with your Ionos account to avoid any login issues. After you've input your email, click next to proceed. The following step requires you to input your password. Enter it carefully as passwords are always case sensitive. Once you've filled in your password, click next once again. With your credentials correctly entered, you'll find yourself logged into your Ionos dashboard. Now for the main event, adding your signature. Locate the gear icon, which is typically positioned at the top right corner of the page. This icon is your doorway to the settings menu, a place where you can customize many aspects of your account, including your email signature. Upon clicking the gear icon, choose the All Settings option to delve deeper into customization. Within the Settings menu, you'll see an option labeled Email. This section is dedicated to all things email related, from managing your inbox rules to setting up auto replies, and of course, creating your email signature. Click on Email to proceed. Next up, navigate to the Signatures section. Here, you can manage existing signatures or add new ones. Since we're focusing on creating a new signature, select the option to add new signature. In the signature creation pane, you'll find a text box where you can type in your desired signature. This could include your full name, position, company name, contact information, and even a professional disclaimer or a friendly note. The space is yours to customize as you see fit. Don't be afraid to make it uniquely yours while keeping it professional. After you're satisfied with your signature, it's time to save it Look for the Save button, usually located somewhere at the bottom or top of the page, and click it. With that click, your new signature is set and ready to accompany your outgoing emails. And there you have it, you've successfully added a signature to your Ionos email account in just a few easy steps. Remember, a well-crafted signature not only provides necessary contact information, but can also convey your professional identity or your brand's image. Feel free to experiment with different signatures for various purposes, perhaps one for formal communications and another with a more personal touch for casual contacts. Just follow these steps again to create and save as many signatures as you need. I hope this guide has been helpful. If you have any questions or need further assistance, don't hesitate to reach out. Happy emailing and see you in our next tutorial.